Hey folks, Justin here. Today we're hopping on a ladder with Dog Park, which is a scout deck using the forgotten child of the Frostspark collection, that is Death Hound. Now, Death Hound's a pretty interesting card. It's a walking, talking ring of imaginary might. Or walking, barking, I guess. Makes more sense. Uh, we're putting it in scout today, and we're going to try to have some meme fun. That's kind of hand you've got. <laughs> It's kind of hand, just gotta respect. Gotta respect it. We'll keep the Dark Guardian. <laughs> Alright, I'll pull out the Assassin. That's a playable card. This might be handy. Alright, so the all the Assassin goes over here, Dark Guardian goes over here. There's Swift Strike for maximum image. So they put a, a Wardcrafter or a 2-2 two, two, a Winkeep Spell Sword over here. It's not great for us. Don't I assume they oppose this, in which case I might just protect it with the Dark Guardian. Careful there, friend. Yeah. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Um, yeah, another Swift Strike's not ideal. Worthy. They can drop the dagger on here. <sighs> what do we got? Oh, they drew a Sorcerer's Negation. Double Swift Strike, not good. Not good at all. A young Mammoth action. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Should have been more worthy. We're all in on the Frost Roll. He's going here. He's also going to get equipped with a Ring of Imaginary Might. <laughs> no Sorcerer's Negation. One time. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It doesn't look like Sorcerer's Negation. Watch yourself now. I'm ready for you. Okay. Alright. No Sorcerer's Negation, no Harpy. Come on, come on, Kekro. Let us cheese some wins here. Face me, you That's dog. too fast. It's too fast if they had an answer. Face me, you dog. Yeah, four colors might keep me alive long enough to develop Snowy Saber Cat. <laughs> yeah! And there's the Harpy. Alright, so we double guard this lane. This absorbs everything in that lane right now. They don't have a negation. Because they would have played it. Can't play High Rothgar. Uh... Dark Guardian. Okay. No Sorcerer's Negation. No Harpy. We swing with the Troll first, so that if they have a Harpy, it hits the Dark Guardian. I see you're in need hmm. of my wisdom. Sure, lethal, breakthrough, guard, guard, drain, lethal, rally. They're still dead. Right? I'm still not dead. Your blood will sure. spill. Face me, you sure. dog. We're almost dead. Not quite. I'm ready. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I just need to dodge two prophecies. Just Harpy. 
Oh, God, that feels good. <laughs> We're going to try one more game with uh, Dog Park after uh, edging out a pretty exciting win in that last one. <laughs> I, I got faith. I believe we can do this. Hoorah. All right. So uh, there are a couple ways you, you meme some wins out of this deck. You play uh, Ring of Imaginary Might on Snowy Saber Cat, and then you Swift Strike it, and you can do 30 damage. 29, no, 27 damage. Um, you can use any of the Ring of Imaginary Might on a stick-type creatures, like, uh, you know, Death Hound, I guess, is the only one. But also Portcullis is awesome. High Rothgar on curve with the ring is not bad. Not going to happen this game. Um, never want to keep Swift Strike. Our opponent is Has No Talent, who's on uh, Archer. I'm going to assume it's Aggro because of their name. And uh, <laughs> I, I kid, I kid. East Empire Crafter. I forgot that was in here. It's so exciting. Alright. So, I'll block the Assassin. And then a bunch of really expensive, unplayable stuff. So, three drop. Battle Rage Orc. Okay. Uh, we're going to play East Empire Crafter. And we're gonna then follow it up with a Dark Guardian, and then uh, probably a Death Hound. Because we are apparently also an East Empire Crafter deck. Really? Die like a dog. Lost Troll's better on curve. It does play right into their Leaf Lurker, which I suspect they have given the way they played this. No, they have Territorial Viper. Okay. Sure. That's a thing they could do. Okay. So Leaf Lurker is their play like next turn. This turn, it's just Death Hound. No way that they have a second, uh, a second Territorial Viper. Follow me, man. Markarth, man. Die like a dog. Okay. We got a lot of damage here. A little Silt Strider action as well. And e they can't have two leaf lurkers, is my point here. <laughs> so last time we saw the power of Ring of Imaginary Might, this time we're seeing the power of uh, East, March East Empire Crafter. Time to fight. Yeah, North Fireman. Talos. Let's do this. Okay. Fires are Interesting. The Nords must take back okay. Skyrim. Into a cliff racer? Wow. Okay, we have a lot of damage. Okay. Well, there's Brynjolf. Die like a dog. I'm just gonna drop him down. <clears throat> little, uh, little crafter here, little factory worker, doing some great, great things with our troops.
So you can swing both your guys in there, and then you die. Um... What kind of deck is this? Voracious Spriggan makes me wonder. <laughs> Alright. There's still a lot of ways we lose, but we do have 8 reach in hand. So we don't need to slap them too many more times. And in case it's... I'm, I'm continuing to put guards in front of that guy, because in the event that it is Market Archer, like I just want to not take damage... Yeah, here come more Nor Firebrands. Okay. And a giant bat. Okay, well, that keeps him alive. This is just like charge creature dot deck. Almost lethal. Die like a dog. All right, now my Cliff Racer is lethal with the Swift Strike. Splitting like this for Vigilant Giant, I guess. <laughs> Sweet. Well, that was cool. That was an interesting deck, and and the the one the two one with Drain now makes sense. So, awesome. Dog Park, man. Good deck. Uh, in case you at home want to play this deck today, this is Dog Park, the uh, deck that features Death Hound. You saw it. Um, it was functional in that last game. Uh, it's a Ring of Imaginary Might High Rothgar deck, right? So High Rothgar, when you summon a creature, its power becomes equal to its health. Ring of Imaginary Might, the wielder's power becomes equal to its health and plus zero, plus two. Uh, great targets for that are Silt Strider, Dark Guardian, uh, Bleak Coast Troll's all right. It's just a good card. Frost Troll, uh, Brynjolf, Deathhound, Portcullis, and Snowy Sabercat. With Snowy Sabercat and, uh, you know, three damage on your opponent's face prior to it, a uh, Ring of Imaginary Might and a Swift Strike is lethal. It's 27 damage. Um, you also have Scout Support to help you get to the stuff, a Glass Helm of Remedy to help boost the toughness of a creature. Porcullus is just a hilarious way to kill people and also, like, kind of a, kind of a powerful prophecy, too. East Empire Crafter, which combos with quite a bit of the creatures in the deck. Combos with Dark Guardian, with Bleak Coast Troll, with Frost Troll, with a lot of uh, other stuff in here. Brynjolf, Deathhound, Portcullis, and Snowy Sabercat. And Tazcat, I guess. Uh, you have an Embassy Disguise and, and some Enchanted Plates to draw you more cards and beef up the toughness of your critters. Silt Strider is just super fun and underplayed. Cute little guy. Uh, the Snake Tooth Necklace just uh, gain some life back while you're trying to assemble all these stupid things. But yeah, it's a, it's a lot of fun, and uh, I hope you enjoy.